Five, three, two, one. Power up. Two robots underway on either side of the field, trying to get the cube into place and taking the switch in autonomous mode is the Blue Alliance. There is the bell, the drivers take control. The launch evader is loaded up and oh, a near miss for lights out. Trying to get the cube in position for another shot. Up and in that time for lights out. The scale is balanced. Getting themselves in position for another block placement. Lights out, taking and changing the scale right in front of the Metal Eagles. The Metal Eagles try to slam dunk a power cube into place in a near miss. The scale will stay in possession of the Red Alliance. Blue Alliance owns their own switch. Red Alliance needs to take theirs back. We'll see if they can get the teamwork together to do that as 68-55 right now, Badger Robotics trying to work on the switch, but Blue just dumps another one in by Apophis, keeping control of the Red Alliance side of the switches. Sixty-six forty right now, the Metal Eagles extending their arm. Very, very top heavy in that position. Can they get themselves in the air enough? As Apophis continues to stack blocks on the switch, the Blue Alliance has the scoreboard right now. Red Alliance trying to take back the control of their own switch, and they are being dominated right now by Blue. 68-55, Badger Robotics parked directly in front of the portal. There is the 32nd horn. Red Alliance needs to make up some ground. Getting ready to climb. Apophis has the snake extended. Can they get themselves in the air? Apophis is going up. And Apophis is airborne now as they have levitated off the field. 7066 up on the ramp. And 323 now on the ramp. Power up play at the end. Don't think it's going to be enough for the Red Alliance. Scores coming up on the screen. Nathan must have pushed the correct button. It's 278 for the Blue Alliance and three ranking points for the Red Alliance.